Hey guys, Ricardo Almeida here. Uh, just gonna show some basic uh, leg entanglements, some entries to, you know, to Ashigarame. It's a game that, you know, we play here a lot, we do a lot of no-gi. Guys do a ton of leg locks. Uh, so I find that I'm constantly uh, concerned about also hiding my legs. Uh, what better way to hide your legs than, you know, having both feet on the inside. If you leave them on the outside, you're always exposed. When I play with guys that have really good leg locks, I try as much as possible to hide, hide my feet, okay? So let's start right here, where you're sitting, okay? First of all, I try not to get under my corner, all right? I try not to create any attacking movement until I've created off balancing, all right? If I could off balance my corner, then I'm gonna enter, okay? So a simple one really would be just to enter more or less, a, you know, like a, a butterfly guard reversal, controlling the arm, okay? So that you're forcing your opponent to post the leg. When you post the leg, we attack that kickstand, all right? Just enter right here. Now from here you have a ton of sweeps on how to finish, right? You could simple take out the trash, or coming up, finishing. If your port starts putting a ton of weight forward, hips up and out, coming over, all right? Those are the main finishes, but try to, when you're gonna enter under your corner, all right? We don't want these legs here. I want my legs here. Guys are throwing the leg over from right there and attacking leg locks. All right? So hiding your feet on the inside, all right? Keeping your head level with your corner. It's, it's a good starting point. Doesn't solve all the problems, but it's a good starting point, all right? So I can attack that way and enter. Another one that's very common, all right? Where guys can you off balancing your corner. If you could create an arm drag, he also has to post that leg up to keep me from going on his back. All right. So this off balance now is the other way. Go back, look, please. If I were to create an arm drag and he doesn't post that leg up, now I have a clear path to his back. So it forces, right? That arm drag is going to force your opponent to pull the leg up from there we're entering, and then you're finishing. You know, whatever is your favorite technique to finish. A lot of the leg lock guys like to go double wash I mean, if you're really comfortable, so they could attack. I don't. I don't. I'm always very careful about keeping my feet on the inside. Thank you.